fellow Sudokans and welcome to Zen and the Art of the Guardian Sudoku Puzzle. It's uh, Sunday the 8th of January 2023. Uh, I love YouTube, I must say, uh, not just because I'm on it, but <laughs> I mean I really use it a lot. I, I watch a lot of stuff on YouTube. My feed, of course, however, is unlike your feed. We don't see the same things, right? My feed seems to be obsessed with something called chat GPT at the moment. Uh, the things that I see uh, are being advertised are lots and lots of videos about how wonderful this new AI uh, application is that can, can do kind of just about everything. Of course, there's lots of, uh, I think you might have seen the art that's currently very popular, a, a uh, artificial intelligence um, in, uh, manufactured art, and I'm doing art in air quotes just in case anybody gets offended by that. But there are other things too, like um, programming uh, applications by um, this, um, you know, chat uh, GPT, etc., uh, etc. Et um, but I was thinking, you know, I, I'm not sure if it's really going to be that good yet or not, because um, they can't even seem to do translations properly. I was watching uh, in my YouTube feed, uh, a, a, a great film came on this today, like a film I'd never heard of, a, a nice French film. F French uh, seem to make uh, great films. And um, this was a, a, something I'd never heard of, quite sweet and quite low budget. Um, I sat and thoroughly enjoyed it. My cat didn't because uh, my cat can't read the subtitles and only speaking English in Thai. I'm afraid he was left out. So, <laughs> but, uh, but the subtitles are what I wanted to talk about is that they were really poor. Um, I kind of had to rewrite them in my head into decent English. You know, um, uh, my French is appalling. Um, but even even at times I thought, oh my God, that's a poor translation. Um, my French is really very poor, but um, just the English was uh, awful, you know. And um, so if they can't even do, tra tra if they can't even translate from Eng from French to English in a reasonable way, uh, what chance do they have of doing other things that require even more complex things than that? Um, and of course the Thai. English translations are abysmal, I have to tell you. Don't ever feel like you can use Google. I've had people uh, ask me about Google translations, and they are terrible when it comes to English and Thai. Don't ever, ever use them for anything apart from like uh, one word or something like that. Appalling. So anyway, that's my uh, uh, thought for uh, this early evening here in Bangkok, and now I shall get on with the game of... Uh, Los Angeles Times Expert level. I'd almost forgotten which Sudoku I'm supposed to be playing there. Right, let's begin then. So I can see eights blocking up this column and this column and across the top row. That's going to give me an eight down there. Um... We have one blocking across here and up here and across here, so that puts one into one of these two squares. So one blocking down here and down here and across here. That's going to give me a one in that square. I can see the twos blocking up here as well to move away from that for the moment, but when I see it, I'll tell you two is in that square there. So then the two's blocking across here like so, and up there is going to put two into that square. We have ourselves sevens blocking down here now. That's a seven. And we have the ones blocking up here and across here. So that's a one. One across here and across here. And this is a very fast start, isn't it? I wonder if we're going to get a, a puzzle with a sting in the tail that it starts off very easy and then gives us something difficult at the end. I've seen it before with the LA Times. Uh, on the other hand, it could just be easy all the way through. Who knows? I can see four across here and four up here. So here's a four, excuse me. Um, so what are we left with in these squares? This is a five and a nine. Uh, we've got four down here and four across here. Here's the four. Five and nine. 
Okay, so in these squares, we are looking for 2, 3, 9 across here, 2, 3, 9 across, uh, up here, I should say, 2, 3, 9. I can see the 2, don't see anything else. So in these squares, we do not have 2, 3, or 9. We must have 5 and 6. What does it mean? 6. Let's see the 6s. Got 6s down here as well, of course. Hmm. Okay, still a few places left. Um, two, three, four. Okay, so we have three and four blocking across these two rows here, so that's going to put three and four here. What does it mean? It means when the 8's block down here and down here and across here, the 8 must be in that square there. I'm going to say it again, 3 and 4, just to help me remember, because my memory is so poor. 3 and 4, so these 7's will be down here. Does that mean anything? We've got 7's in those... Oh, no, we've got 7. <laughs> How about that? Stop that and put the easy 7 in there. And then, of course, 7 down here. So that has to be a 7, doesn't it? Right, I'm going to come back again. Say again, 3 and 4. And so the missing digits are 5. Well, we've got the 5 blocking down the middle, so that puts 5 there. So 5 also in these squares here. Does that mean anything? Um, not sure yet. Okay, let's try again. 3 and 4. So... Actually, uh, let's see what else is missing. Th f f three, four, so five, six, nine, isn't it? In those squares, these three missing squares here. So the fives are there. The six and nines we don't know anything about yet. No, no sixes or nines here. Uh, I can work out what's across here just in case it helps because I know I've got six and nine in these squares and I've got three and four four here so that me that means in the middle we've got two eight nine no sorry two eight seven I should say okay we've got two and seven blocking down here here's the eight and then sevens will be here and twos will be here uh, now what two and seven so here we're looking for five six nine in these squares and we don't know which is which yet so we'll come back to that later um where to okay i can see eight blocking across here eight blocking across here and eight up here that gives me an eight there we'll go eight up here and up here and across here let's place out eight there is that a lot yes that was the last one i thought it might be okay we have four blocking this square and four blocking this square so in this row that's the four and we will be left with uh, six and nine any sixes or nines ah. is this a oh it's a there's no nine in there. <laughs> I haven't got around to looking for a nine yet there aren't any nines on the grid I can't see any I think it's a it's a nine free grid. How about that? I only just noticed it. Got most of the way through the game, or well, let's halfway through the game maybe, and didn't even notice that we didn't have a nine. Oh dear. Okay, so I do know that the nines are over here. Uh, is that right? No. Yes, over here and and here and here and there and there and there and there. So, um, you know, somewhere down here. 
it's not entirely unknown and also in these squares right so it's not exactly entirely unknown that means nines will be there nines still possible up there I guess Uh, nine, oh, it's still possible up here as well. Okay, all right. <laughs> stop, stop, stop. Forget that for now. Uh, let's go on what we already have. Let's see now. We have one across here, across here, up here, and down here. So it looks like the final one. Yes, it was. What's happening with the twos? Well, we have two blocking across here, up here, and down here. But two blocking down here so it puts two in one of those squares so this can't be two that must be two there that's going to leave us with twos in those squares to finish what's going on with the threes we've got threes uh, okay we've got three blocking across here so three in one of those squares this can't be three we've got three blocking up here here is our three that's going to put threes down like this threes are here so threes are in those squares there there and there damn <laughs> that's these this kind of pattern is not solvable um okay but we shall bear that in mind how we're we doing on fours uh okay we've got the fours mostly done they just look like that the fives Let's draw them in. Mm. No, too many places over here, I guess. Let me get your message. Okay. Nothing I have to respond to. Uh, sixes. So six in those squares, somewhere there, in one of those squares, I mean, and... Ah, okay, gotcha. So six blocks down here. So six is in one of these squares here, meaning that can't be six, this can't be six, that must be six. And we're left with a nine and something, of course, for this column, nine and five. Now, actually, we know because the five blocks up here, we got five this square, so this can't be five. So it is our first nine, da-da! And five will appear here and five blocks here so here's the five and that's our nine and then nine blocking down here is our nine and this would be a six and six blocks up here so this is our six and this is our five right that was exciting kind of Um, we are going to have, oh no, 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 yes we are, we are going to have fives in these squares, these squares, um, but still too much there, okay, how are we doing on sixes now? Okay, seven blocks across here, so that puts it in one of these two squares. Let's go eastwards, seven blocking here, seven blocking up here. Here's our seven. Uh, where else do we need seven? Okay, we need sevens in those squares there. Eight is already done, and nine is still to do. All right, back now. So there's just one missing number here. Looks to me a three three blocking up here three across here so here's a three three down here and three across here so here's a three uh, 
uh, four blocks across here, so four in one of these two squares, so blocking up here, four blocking down here, and four across here puts the four into that square. Actually, I just realized there was a four down here. I could place that four. I said in one of these two squares. I didn't notice there was a four there. I've seen it now. No need to complain in the comment section. We have six blocking this square here. That means this must be six for the column and nine will finish it. Still a lot of nines to find. Nine blocking across here. Here's a nine. This would be a three. Uh, three across here. Three down here. Here's a three. Uh, which was the last one. I can get this number here, can't I? We'll just find out what's missing here, which is uh, five and six, I believe. Yeah, and so this will have to be a seven. Seven down here, seven across these two rows. There's a seven. Finish this row with two. Two up here. That puts a two in that square, and this will be a five five blocks this square we need a five in this bottom row so that's where it must go and this will be nine I think hey what's missing here you are a six I do believe then the six blocking up here so six here is this one of our missing nines from the beginning I think it is yep nine across there so there's our nine the last number here I think is a six as well six blocking down here here is the six uh, we're looking for a five in this square, five blocking down here, and here is the five. So quite fittingly, the last number to fill in is a nine, which was the last one to be um, uh, got to get any of them. Digits, I should say, you know what I mean. We didn't have any at the beginning, so it ought to be the last one to finish up the grid. That's it for the LA Times Expert Level Game. Another very easy game uh, for today. So uh, I hope you uh, managed to play that quite well yourselves. Bye bye.